Welcome back, fellow citizens of JAR. Today we're in for Super President. This is the show in which we try to build our own country, take over the entire universe, and fix all of the universe's problems. I just went outside. I did a jog. And I'm stinky. That's right. I'm a stinky boy who's going to do a comment show. And afterwards, I'm going to do stinky dishes. Because I don't want to shower until I've done all my stinky chores. Just thought you should know that. I'm still wearing my stink clothes. <laughs> Am I in your good book? Of course you are in my good book. It's a stinky book right now, but afterwards when I'm done this, it will be a showered book. And by that I mean a ruined book because most books aren't good in the shower. Even Kindles don't work well in the shower. We need to fix that. I have a new invention idea, waterproof books. <laughs> How is this family not? at 1,000 subscribers. I don't know, you tell me. Take this video, go down to the street corner and show 12 people. Don't act, don't actually do that. I don't know, if, if any of you have friends you think might like it. Hi friends. Hi, welcome new friends to this, whatever that this mess is. I'm curious, if Darren chose to hold an election, not saying he should, if he would go and challenge or go on to win the vote 100%. It can be a very interesting thing at one point in time, but I'd be scared to just lose my channel for, for my own reasons and fault. <laughs> I think it would be awesome if you made a video with Rachel and Luke. I made a, I made a picture. <laughs> a schedules and ideas figure out. Maybe. Thank you, great super president. It's an honor to have my work being a thing here. Could it be played when we add more Earth? Also, I will continue to expand the anthem. I think it's a cool idea. I will need to record a version that's not whatever I did last time. <laughs> Here's an idea for these people. Let's not form a religious cult. That that could that could be a little offensive to some people. No, the official religion of Jar, as I've stated, I think many years ago, it's a mirror religion. So whichever religion you follow, Jar follows as well. And for other people, whichever religion, non-religion, or whatever they follow, Jar follows that as well. It's basically just freedom of religion, but dressed up like a Christmas present. So it so it's more fun. <laughs> I subscribed on 300 subs. We've come quite a way. I know, we've gotten a lot bigger. And as we put more work, effort, and chutzpah into the channel, we will grow even more. And more. And more. <laughs> How's the space program series? On the ground. It'll be in space, though. I need to plan out each of the- I have like 19 running series. Which I kind of like because then I can go back to each one at any point in time if I feel like it. But it is jumbled. It's just who I am as a person. <laughs> How can the US government fine you if you label it wrong? You live in Canada. I live in the UK. Yes, and me living in Canada and people living in the States need to hit accept on every cookie thing because of a European Union law about privacy. So, <sighs> unfortunately, two things. One, it's international and there's international death. And two, YouTube is an American company, so even if they wouldn't find you, apparently they've never they've never find a non-American one, but they've kind of hinted they might this time, because um, it technically might not be in their jurisdiction. Regardless, they can still delete your entire Google account, including my my email and everything, if they feel like it, because they're an American company. So, it's still not great. <laughs> You're a cool dude. You're pretty cool yourself. Although up here in Canada right now. Most things are pretty cool. That's a temperature joke. Does this count as a science channel now? <laughs> Button Dynasty thinks we should divide Jar into three regions. I don't think we have enough population to divide Jar into two regions quite yet, so help me grow and then maybe we'll work on that. Also, it's really funny that there is a Jarland flag as a hypothetical. He links it here, which I find funny. So technically and literally, Jar is a bowl of dirt. It's a jar of dirt. I'm just assuming that was autocorrect on your phone. But yeah, no, it's... It's dirt. It's in a jar. <laughs> you should put a poll on your YouTube channel on who would be super president. I would vote for you. P.S. I have a micronation called the Kingdom of Citterland. The problem with free and fair elections is that they're free and fair, and... Maybe I can't win a fair fight. <laughs> don't know. You can declare independence and make your house an autonomous republic. I could, but I have a feeling the government of Canada would have words with my face and body 
and a jail cell, so I'm gonna not do that. <laughs> you can go to Beer Towel. I have a feeling if I went there, two different countries would be mad at me, and I prefer not to be another white guy going to unclaimed land and taking it. <laughs> Kim Jong-un isn't the leader of North Korea. Kim, it's still Kim Il-sung. Didn't he die, like, a long time ago? Is this one of those, like, weird propaganda things where everywhere Kim Jong-un steps, flowers spring up that I'm not aware of? I'm not fully up on my North Korean history. <laughs> so I think we can rule out an invasion of the world. Hey, just because I can't beat up any other world leaders Yes. <laughs> we should invade the Vatican once we have the population to invade. There's a lot of invasion talks going on <laughs> amongst jar citizens. I think that if you can't beat them, make them slowly like you enough, and then maybe one day they'll join you is a, is a good strategy though. I like that one. Let's see if we can get them to subscribe to a YouTube channel. Is that likely? On the scale of world leaders, Darren is utterly average. I think you'll find I'm somewhat moderately below average. <laughs> But still hanging in there. Local Canadian attempts to beat up Pope. Results inconclusive. No, I think he'd win right now. Give it a year, maybe I'll have, a, have an advantage. <laughs> also, I don't have a cool hat. He's got, I think, definitively the most cool hat. It's gotta count for something. In RPG equipment terms, it's gotta give him a plus one to charisma or something. <laughs> Boris Johnson equals failed clone of Trump. Hilarious. I wish this was my analogy. This is actually like a common analogy over in Britain, apparently. It's very true though, like look at this. <laughs> it's like a super fan of Trump trying to cosplay as Trump, but only having the Halloween wigs at the local store that they can go buy, but going, eh, I have the party this weekend, this is good enough, I'll just go with that. So this has been your super presidential candidate, Darren, signing off for Monday, saying welcome to JAR. JAR takes all kinds. You are family now. Please join us this week and every week. We go up every single Saturday and Monday. Don't forget to check the description down below for links to some fun things, and I will leave you as always with our viewer submitted motto for JAR, which is, we are JAR. If you love JAR, you love us. See you Saturday. And this episode is brought to you by Luke and Rachel with me in the middle, like a big hug that that I that people pay me for <laughs> money.